today from Dnipro in Ukraine and right behind me is a makeshift memorial for the more than 40 people that died in the bombing of this building on Saturday. Today we met some people who survived the bombing. One man told us that he only heard silence when the blast hit and then he realized he was bleeding. He could then hear the screams of women and children and realized he had to go outside. Once he got outside, the situation was even more horrifying. He could see cars and his building on fire. Then, about 20 minutes after the initial blast, his building collapsed. Now he and about 300 other people are homeless. Officials say they are still working out how they are going to try to compensate people. They're also still trying to figure out if the building can, in fact, be rebuilt at all. Um, and the survivors say they just don't know what they will do next. Reporting from Dnipro in Ukraine, this is Heather Murdoch, VOA News.